I don't really remember wanting to be anything other than an artist. And uh, the first uh, memory I have of thinking that I wanted to be an artist was when I was in that, um, kindergarten. And when she did get to me, she paused and then didn't say anything and then kept moving. And the student next to me, I can't remember who they are now, um, she stopped and said, oh, that's so amazing. It's all in the lines and perfect. And I remember thinking, oh, and I looked at mine and it was all out of the lines and uh, chaotic. And I just remember thinking to myself, oh, she just can't tell that I'm an artist. <laughs> and so I, I think, yeah, when I was about five going on six, I just had this uh, strange ambition that I was, I was an artist. And that's what I followed through with. At that very young age really taught me a lot about what was to come. Being an artist is not easy. Uh, you need to be really resilient and it's quite personal making work and putting it out there for an audience. And I went to art school and studied um, printmaking. I didn't have a press or anything to print it with so I remember printing it by sitting on it and in my interview when I explained how I'd printed it to Jörg Schmeiser who he really found that pretty intriguing I think so we got a good laugh out of it. So I ended up choosing printmaking. Really, when I came back to Bathurst and found myself here, and the landscape and that inspiration that I had as a younger person, being in nature and connecting to the environment as a subject for me to move forward and make work about. You know, still the recognition is is kind of swayed towards male artists in Australia and also globally. And through gender politics I learnt um, about the Gorilla Girl. Being a woman working with beauty, um, it can be dismissed as uh, decorative or pretty or irrelevant. Um, and I think that that kind of reading of a woman's work would be quite different if it were produced by Male. I think in the arts men and women are working really hard to, to even that out. Learning about the Gorilla Girls was inspiring for my practice going forward because it really, uh, they really have fought hard to raise awareness around um, the inequities in art, not necessarily in Australia but globally. For me to be out in the landscape making the work, it's physically um, sometimes quite difficult. The shoots can go for 24 hours, the conditions can be uncomfortable um, and I like that idea of pushing myself, my body and uh, uh, to the extreme and making work that on the surface may be quite beautiful and um, refined but the actual making of the work was robust and difficult hard and I have had people who you know met me in real life go oh you know you're a lot tinier and sort of um, feminine than we thought so I like to challenge that I guess in my work that challenge stereotypes because when I'm not making it's just life's a bit boring really <laughs> so I like the challenge <laughs> and um, yeah, I think we're at an exciting time for Australian arts and also women in the arts. <laughs> my name is Nicole Welch and this is my perspective.